We have police officer appointments. And this evening, the Board of Selectmen will consider appointing Moira Molly McGaffigan and Jay Deanna. D am I pronouncing that right? Is it Deanna or Diana? Diana. 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 Uh, <laughs> Jay Diana as full time police officers. Both are currently student officers and have recently graduated from the Randolph Police Academy. So, welcome. Well, it's a great night for the HPD. We have two outstanding candidates. Um, I couldn't be uh, more proud of them and the work they put in the academy. They did outstanding uh, applying for the job, testing and interview procedures. I'll read a little bit about them and they're, they're both special people that are really going to be special for communities, especially when it comes to uh, uh, working for charitable things. I'll just give you one example. Uh, Molly grew up in Groton, Mass. She graduated from Bishop Curtin High School in Nashville, New Hampshire. It was a graduate from St. El Enslin College in 2015 with a major in criminal justice and a double minor in forensic studies and sociology. While at St. Enslin College, Molly was a, uh, was a four year starter in the nationally ranked Division II women's lacrosse team. Molly interned with the Massachusetts State Police Tactical Operations Team and Immigration Customs Enforcement with St. Enzel. Molly is a nine-year ovarian cancer survivor who has dedicated nearly a decade of service to training on awareness and funding for nonprofit ovarian cancer organizations. To this date, she has raised over 60000 to advance the cause of ovarian cancer. She has been recognized by the, uh, several organizations, including the New England Patriots, the Boston Celtics, for her outstanding community service. Molly's previous jobs included uh, service in her family's uh, funeral home business, the Gatlin uh, uh, Funeral Home in Pepperell, Mass. She's most recently served as an animal, full, animal welfare agent of the Massachusetts Society for Prevention of Cruelty to Animals. In her spare time, Molly enjoys coaching high school girls lacrosse, dragon boat racing, <laughs> <laughs> and summering on the Irish River Vera in Situate, Mass. In January of 2018, <laughs> she attended Randolph uh, Municipal Police Academy. Molly is the daughter of John Patricia McGaffin. We're here tonight. They have Groton, a sibling, uh, Aaron, and Michael McGaffin. Molly, that is a wonderful resume. We are so privileged and pleased to have you have you join us. Thank you very much. I'm very excited for the opportunity. We're very excited to have you on the force. Folks, questions or comments from Molly? Mr. Manasso? Hearing your resume and what you've been through, um, surviving cancer is uh, its incredible. Um, I'm so impressed to hear everything that you've done at such a young age that um, I feel safer knowing that you're going to be in town. Thank you. Yes, actually, you know, thank you very much for for choosing Hockett. We're, we're choosing you, but you had to choose us, and um, we're very pleased to have you here. You know, as you could as you could hear at the beginning of the meeting, you know, we're a com we're a community that that believes in in giving and giving back, and you've absolutely proved yourself as um, as a person that's going to fit in here beautifully. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Tenstone. Well, congratulations for making it through the academy, <laughs> and. Um, for being chosen to be one of our newest officers. Uh, it's a great town to work in. And uh, you know, from the chief to the lieutenants to the sergeants to the patrolmen, you've got a pretty good group of people that you're gonna learn from. So you learn from the best, take advantage of it. And uh, thank, you for, thank you for sticking with it and welcome to Hockenden. Thank you. To her. Thanks for joining, great to see you. Um, I'm very impressed with what you've done so far in your life and some of the things you've overcome in your life. And I think that will bode well for you, not only in this job, but for the rest of your life. So uh, it's an honor to have you on the team. And uh, as an active uh, fundraiser in the cancer uh, research world, uh, I think you're a perfect fit for our town. Thank you. We could not be happier. So welcome to Hoffington. We hope you'll be happy here. And I know we'll be, we're delighted to have you join us. Thank you very much. It's great. Okay, not to be outdone. <laughs> <laughs> Very tough to be. Yeah. <laughs> Jay, you got issues. Yeah. <laughs> He's Did a you hometown you? kid. This will, this will be I quick. just couldn't imagine. <laughs> 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 He's shaking his head. Yeah. 
Jay Diana grew up in Hopkins, Mass. He is married to his wife, Alexandria, who he has two daughters with, Gabriel and Haley. Jay attended Hopkins High School and graduated in 2008. After graduating high school, Jay attended and graduated from Mass Bay Community College with a degree in criminal justice. In 2014, Jay completed the Boylston Reserve Intermittent Police Academy. Jay worked as a part-time dispatcher for the Hopkins Police Department in 2014 before becoming a full-time police officer at Simmons College in Boston. In January of 2018, he attended the Randolph Municipal Academy before starting back here, hopefully as a full-time officer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jay has run five Boston marathons, and that's pretty mm -hmm. good, so. raising money for various groups, including Hopkinton Running Club and the Hopkinton Police Association. He looks forward to continue, continue uh, to help Hopkinton as he considers a great community. Jay is uh, the son of William, Diana, and Karen Diana. Jay? Uh, I just want to thank you all for this opportunity. Uh, I've, I've grown up in this town. I know it very well. Uh, I love this town. I have deep love for this town. I also love my family, and I just really look forward to uh, serving this town and uh, watching it keep growing as the great community it is. Thank you. It's really nice when people come back home, and uh, I just am delighted that we can we can have our own Hopkinton uh, kids stay here and prosper and, and, and want to come back and give to the community that's given to them. So, um, you know, it's great when we attract the best from all over, and yet there's something really nice that we can that we can keep our our talented folks. Uh, right back here at home. So it's great to be welcoming you, Jay. I'm really pleased that you're going to be joining the force full time. Thank you. Mr. Hart? Uh, another perfect fit, a uh, hometown guy uh, that's run the marathon, that knows that whole shtick and, and deal. And uh, uh, coming out of Hopkinton <coughs> High School, knowing what the kids go through uh, not that long ago. So uh, I think it's a great fit for our town. And we're lucky to have you. And great to see you staying in town. So thanks, Jay. Thank you, sir. Well, Mr. Diana, <laughs> uh, reflecting back, I, I think back of when, uh, when I was coming up through the ranks, the, the guys that we had on the department back then, on a Friday night if we were heading to a bingo, uh, we had Rick Flannery and John Litchfield to run through the woods to, cut, to chase us. Uh, there's no way there's any kid that's outrunning you. You know the woods. <laughs> <laughs> so I was going to say something, Brendan, but I decided not to. <laughs> so, uh, You're giving so, away his cover. <laughs> yeah, so I've known Jay since he was just a little guy. I've known his family. Um, actually, when I used to work at the prison, uh, Jay was close to going over and taking a CO job there. And uh, I'm really, really glad that he didn't. Uh, Jay's a great kid. He's always been a great kid, uh, despite the lineage that we have with our families and, and how, how good friends we've been for, for our whole lives. Uh, on a professional note, I'm real glad to see you here. Congratulations. And it warms my heart to know that you're on the force. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Thanks for staying in town. You know, it's, it's, you, you definitely don't, won't need a GPS to get around. No, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, the, all the shortcuts. No, really, no, thanks, you know, thanks for sticking it out. Thanks for, uh, for staying in town. You know, it, it's, you know, to have somebody that's, that's come through um, Hopkins High School, you know, we're, we're all nervous and worried that uh, OP is going to retire in some, at some point. You know, and my, I know my, my youngest daughter is just hoping that he hangs out uh, until she graduates. But you know, but to have somebody, as Brian mentioned, going coming through Hopkins High School, you know how the school works. You know how all the uh, schools work. The kids, the, the 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 makeup of the town. So to have you here, as much as as um, the other officers will be training you, you can still fill them in. Sort of what what Brendan does with us on the board sometimes, and brings us some uh, but local local color, so to speak. <laughs> um, but you no, know, thanks very much for for staying in town and and, and uh, giving us a shot. Thank you, sir. So I'm not aware personally of your local color, as we. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's a good thing. <laughs> um, all I can say is, I mean, as another person who has uh, come back, who left for education and, and came back, you know, we realized uh, what we love about this town and how much it how much it means to us. 
And to see uh, someone who's graduated in 2008 and, and here you are back uh, 10 years later, it is a privilege of mine personally to welcome you to the force. Welcome you back to town. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Thank you all. And, and speaking of the young people, just made me think how both of you, Molly and Jay, in different ways bring different um, things that are really, really valuable and, and just timely for the needs of the town and particularly the young kids and, you know, the ability to relate and um, understand. And so I think you're, you're both going to be a real, a real asset and, and bring some very important uh, talents and resources to our force. So it's a, it's a happy evening to be able to welcome both to you to the force. Congratulations. Thank you, man. Thank you very Thank much. You. A motion. I guess I do. All right. Let's make this official. I request a motion to appoint Moira McGaffigan and Jay Diana as full-time police officers for the town of Hopkinton. So moved. Second. It's been moved and seconded. All those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? It is unanimous and welcome aboard. Nice. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you.